What's up, Pika guys? And welcome to another top five video. So, Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon really improved on the good old Sun and Moon. While most people are talking about new additions like the Ultra War Pride, Mantine Surf, and other such features, today we are going to talk about the minor changes which made the game much better. So without further ado, let's begin. Number 5. Minor Graphical Updates The starting Route 1 and Exeggutor Island are so much different than in Sun and Moon. But not only that, there are many minor graphical updates which mostly remain unnoticed. Here are a few examples. Number 4. Change in Text Just like there are minor graphical updates, there's many small changes in text that change the story from that of Sun and Moon. Here's a few screenshots to show such edits in text. Number 3. The change in the battle screen. The battle screen is amazing in Ultra. First we have the starting rainbow-like animation, which is much better than the weird kaleidoscope thingy in Sun and Moon. Now something many have talked about is the removal of that paintbrush-like look in the Pokemon name area. It makes the screen so much cleaner. The bottom screen is so much better too. It looks more sharper, and the new colors representing the types really make it look much better. Number 2. The Transition It's amazing to see how Game Freak changes things up in Ultra. It's fascinating how the story merges with Sun and Moon and how it changes up. For example, as we get the starters before saving Nebi, we get to battle a Spearow. Another great example would be how we travel between Mele Mele and Akal Islands using Mantine Surf, but still Game Freak manages to mix it with bits of Sun and Moon, like when meeting Olivia. It's also cool how the cutscene is different when Luzamine goes into Ultra Wormhole to defeat Necrozma. All this helps make Ultra the better version. Number 1. The Music Pokemon Sun and Moon had an amazing soundtrack. But the great part is how Game Freak remixed some of the themes and made them even better. My favorite new remix theme is the Trainer Battle theme. Even themes like Ultra Necrozma's have bits of Solgaleo and Lunala's old theme. It was amazing how Ultra Ruin, the Ultra Space of Guzzlord, was a remix of Haoli City, showing that Ultra Ruin is a ruined Haoli City. And these are some of the minor changes that make Ultra so much better than Sun and Moon. So that's all for today's video. Be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't. So until next time, Pika guys, bye bye.